Benoni Defense, Modern, Penrose Variation, 7, BG78.NGE2009.006. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Black played better than white in the opening. The middle game battle was fairly even. Both players had incredible precision in the end game. In the English opening, white plays c4 to take control of the d5 square without sacrificing a central piece. This is a more patient opening. Nf6 develops the knight toward the center and controls the e4 square. The conflict for the e4 square is started with nc3, which controls d5. g6 prepares to fianchetto the dark squared bishop on g7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. As a result, the bishop grows and gains flexibility on the long diagonal. Bd3 develops the bishop to a square where it protects the e4 pawn. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. Nge2 develops the knight toward the center, supports the d4 pawn and the knight on c3. c5 gains space in the center and attacks the d pawn. d5 gains space in the center and controls the square c6 and e6. e6 challenges white's d pawn and controls f5. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. It is a fair deal after all captures. Backs off. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is the final book action. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Although the score was nearly equal, white now has the upper hand. It is incorrect. Although white lost their edge, the game is still almost evenly matched. It is incorrect. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. A better technique to recapture a piece is missed by this. It is incorrect. As a result, the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. That's good. This misses a chance to defend against an assault on a helpless pawn. It is incorrect. Not the finest, this. It is incorrect. This deters an assault on a pawn that is weak. It is ideal. The bishop is now in a secure position. It is ideal. The knight can now control more squares as a result. It is ideal. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. That's good. This exposes an attack, threatening a pawn. This is the only good move. It is a great move. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is quite good. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is incorrect. That falls flat. This is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Backs off. It is ideal. This misses a chance to protect a pawn that was being attacked. It is incorrect. This enables the adversary to disclose an assault on a queen. It is incorrect. There was only one good move there. This overlooks an opportunity to reveal an attack on a queen. It is a mistake. This is not the best approach. It is incorrect. This ignores an opportunity to reveal an attack on a queen. It is an inaccuracy. This could have been done lot better. It is incorrect. This takes an outpost, an active square where the knight cannot be kicked out by a pawn. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Although the game was nearly tied, white is now in a losing position. It is incorrect. This threatens to fork pieces. This misses a chance to obtain a winning position. It is a miss. Very precise. It is best. This forks multiple pieces. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This moves the queen to safety. 
This is the only move that works. This threatens to win a knight. It is a great move. This misses a chance to seize a helpless rook. It is incorrect. This raises the possibility of an eventual checkmate. It is incorrect. This succeeds in capturing a helpless rook. It is ideal. This removes the attacking knight. This is the only good move. This threatens to force eventual checkmate. It is a great move. That was a great move and very hard to find. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to win a queen. It is brilliant. This overlooks an opportunity to move a bishop to safety. This permits the opponent to create a passed pawn. It is a mistake. This makes a passed pawn, meaning no opposing pawn can challenge it on its way to promotion. This is the only good move. This was a game-changing move, giving black a winning position. It is best. The knight becomes more active as a result, gaining control over more of the board. This poses a material threat. It is ideal. This results in the loss of a rook. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. It is a mistake. This misses a great but hard to find move. There was only one good move in that position. This ignores a better way to win a rook. It is a miss. Recaptures. It is ideal. This forks pieces by creating a simultaneous attack. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. There was only one good move there. This misses a better way to evade the check from the opposing pawn. It is a mistake. This is a missed chance to seize a helpless rook. It is incorrect. Backs off. This might indicate that a rook was attacked. It is ideal. This is the only move that works. This threatens to fork pieces. It is a great move. Thus, a pawn is lost. It is a mistake. It was a free pawn there. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This leaves a pawn without defenders. This threatens to win a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This misses the chance to claim a free pawn. That falls flat. Recaptures. Black is equal at this point in the endgame. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. This is the only good move. It is a great move. That's a decent move. That's good. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This forks multiple pieces. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This moves the checking rook farther away. It's compelled. It was open season on that night. It is ideal. This poses a risk of winning a rook. It is ideal. This moves the rook to safety. This threatens to promote a pawn to a queen. It is best. This prevents the adversary from elevating a pawn to a queen. It is ideal. This threatens to win a pawn. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This avoids the rook's check. It is ideal. This overlooks an opportunity to create a passed pawn. This allows the opponent to create a passed pawn. It is an inaccuracy. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is incorrect. This makes it impossible for the adversary to advance a passed pawn. It is quite good. The pawn is now passed because it can no longer be opposed as it attempts to promote by other pieces. It is ideal. This turns the pawn into a passed pawn, which means no other pawn may oppose it as it advances. It is quite good. A passed pawn is pushed by this. This raises a pawn to the rank of queen. That's good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. 
that game was pretty competitive. Black played better than white in the opening. The middle game battle was fairly even. Both players had incredible precision in the end game.